Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today we are back in Apache Junction at the Paradise Mobile Home Park, and we are looking at a 1996. This is a new listing. It is a 16 wide by 64, two bedroom, two bath, Cavco manufactured home. And uh, we haven't had a listing in Paradise for a while. This lady uh, actually just purchased another property from us in another community so now she has this one up for sale but one nice thing you'll notice about these lots is they're really a good size um, the homes are not right on the street um, you've got a really nice kind of front area here um, some people actually will put uh, pavers down and make these like uh, front sun patio areas but a really cute community nice wide streets uh, close proximity to uh, the freeways, shopping, banking, Walmart, uh, nothing's too far away. And uh, we're gonna go inside and take a look. Cute little walkway. And uh, nice steps, <coughs> sturdy railings, nice platform step area here, kind of a mini deck. And we're supposed to get some uh, some rain and some snow up north. It's the day before Thanksgiving. And this is Sally. <laughs> Have you ever been on YouTube before, Sally? No, I haven't. Well, there's a first time for everything, right? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I was just um, noting outside, one thing that I really like about these lots is that the homes are set back quite a bit. So you're not like right up on the street. There's a mm -hmm. lot of nice space on these particular mm -hmm. lots. And uh, and we'll go over the space rent here in just a minute. But um, Sally had purchased this. This was about less than a year ago, right? Yes. Okay. And uh, so all these uh, improvements to the property uh, were done uh, when she purchased the home, it has this beautiful laminate floor covering, nice big living room, and a big breakfast bar counter area. You can see the bar stools fit nicely there, and that's a nice big wide countertop. Um, the only furniture that she's going to be leaving um, is the, uh, the table and chairs, uh, but all the appliances stay, correct? Yes. And for people that like gas cooking, this has the really nice stainless steel four burner gas range and uh, stainless steel Salamana appliances, side by side refrigerator, dishwasher. And they really did a nice job on the finish work too. It's got some nice tile backsplash here, that gray and white. Uh, cool tone decor. She's got a built in pantry here. And vaulted ceiling, shingle roof. Has the two inch faux wood blinds throughout, ceiling fans. Nice big, I mean, this this gives them a lot of options in the living room, and you can really tell the difference with 16 wide versus 14 wide. Yes, for, sure. <laughs> for sure. So um, what's making you decide that you want it? I know everybody's going to be wondering, why are you even selling this place? <laughs> Just want something a little bit bigger. Yeah. I'm going with three bedrooms, so yeah. I have a lot of family. Yeah. But it, at least it gave you a chance to get your feet wet down here, have a place to kind of hang your hat and get used to the area so you could look around for something yes. larger. Yep. So um, you're giving this up awfully quickly. So you have a great price on this, $27.9, and it'll be available for possession uh, by the end of December. Yes. And uh, space rent in this community, that's another really big uh, selling point here is the site fees. So um, including your water, sewer, and garbage, it runs you what, like four sixty a month? Yeah, right in there, four fifty, four sixty. Yeah, and most of these communities, I mean, it's really hard to find anything under six hundred a month now with all the rent increases. So, 
super great uh, affordable site fees beautiful home and this is on a perimeter location as well um, I'll go ahead and take them back and show them the rest of the property Thank you. Um, but <clears throat> it's on a perimeter too which is nice because you don't have anybody right behind you but at some point the uh, heat and air was uh, also upgraded so it has the inner therm um, gas furnace there's a little bit of storage here the second bedroom which would easily accommodate a queen bed another ceiling fan so it's got a closet that goes over a little bit past the door some shelving full-size washer and dryer with some overhead storage and a hanging rod. Cute second bathroom. So it's got a little bit of an extension on the vanity. Some updated lighting fixtures and looks like a hanging mirror. This has a tub and shower combination. And the top flush commode. Everything looks like it's in really great shape. Medicine cabinet. Master bedroom is a good size also. Currently accommodates a king size bed, but lots of nice wall space. The sliding wardrobe here, and that goes over too. So lots of nice hanging space. Has the French door entry into the master bathroom. Another extended vanity, really cute property. I love the color scheme. Got built-in linen right here in the bathroom. She uses for some of her toiletry as well. And a really large walk-in shower. That is gigantic. Very nice. And these doors are nice. They <laughs> They slide very easily, but they are not light and flimsy. They are nice, heavy glass doors. And then you've got the frosted glass window. Two of them. Just a lovely property. It's so clean. <laughs> all right so now we'll go outside i'll show you the perimeter so here's part of the covered patio this is her little tow trailer See that cloud cover coming in. So this is a day and night uh, air conditioner. And uh, this is another nice little area right here too. This is a pet friendly community. These folks just arrived yesterday. So it's a mixed use, manufactured homes, mobile homes, and RVs. Has a really large uh, shed. So it looks like it has some electric. 
I can't see electric switch here, so I don't know where that goes to, but some shelving and uh, the skirting was removed here. So you can look underneath and kind of see what, how these things are set up. So you can see it's on pads concrete pads and posts and those are set up I don't know if I've ever been underneath and shown you guys underneath on any of these so this is where like a plumbing repair repair would have been and so um, like on a home inspection um, they'll suggest um, replacing that insulation and patching that vapor barrier that's what that black stuff is so the insulation and then the vapor barrier and a lot of times when the plumbers come, they'll have to remove that, get into it to fix the plumbing, and then they just leave it that way. And most of the time people don't know until they have a home inspection, <laughs> but it's very common. But um, yeah, so there you go. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then, this is the water heater, so it's got a gas water heater also. Nice big one. And then the carport. So she's gonna be taking her golf cart, but it does have some privacy screening. But you can't beat that site fee and be able to find a nice 16 wide newer manufactured home in a community where you can have pets and the site fees are so low uh, like I said close proximity to pretty much everything anyone would need um, and a great price 27.9 so if you're interested in this property the web reference number on this one is pd 256 aj and as always i want to thank you guys uh for your likes comments shares suggestions and uh if you haven't yet subscribed make sure to do so click that subscribe button and you can turn notifications on by clicking the little bell and once you click that bell and turn on notifications youtube will notify you by email just as soon as one of these new videos is posted to our site and you'll have first shot we do post our videos on YouTube before we uh, link them to any of the other websites that we advertise on and uh, so you'll get first shot at all these great new listings we hope everybody has a safe holiday talk to you soon